The town of Monroe, among the many areas in western Connecticut, saturated by historic heavy rain on Sunday. Thankfully, no injuries were reported in town, but the flooding led to countless road closures, damaged homes, and created a gaping hole at one wedding venue. Water was coming out so big, it was like a giant fire hose. John Royce is a co-owner of the Waterview in Monroe. He explained that the property has a parking lot drainage system that drains water through a singular pipe. Uh, boxes, concrete boxes, where it dissipates. It, the force of the water was so strong, it just blew apart the tea, and then it started to erode the ground. And so when the water burst the pipes, it just immediately just took out the whole side of the, uh, this area here and ended up in the water. This is what that sinkhole looks like a few days later. Crews have been working to fill it in and expected to take about two to three weeks to completely repair it. But unsurprisingly, this did lead to a pretty big change in plans for two different families that were hosting events here on Sunday afternoon. One was a wedding and the other one was a sweet 16. And so people didn't realize it until the emergency services came here. They weren't really sure if this was going to uh, unstructure, unstable the building itself. Emergency crews decided to evacuate the building as a precaution, though the town has since cleared the building to resume normal operations. Well, of course, we wanted to make sure that the property was stable and it was safe for all our clients. Um, once we found that out, I was very relieved. There are other outdoor ceremony areas for couples getting married. We're told that the couple whose wedding was evacuated on Sunday is now on their honeymoon and will be getting a full refund from Waterview. The other event has been rescheduled. So we're just happy nobody got hurt. And if this is the worst that it could be, that is okay with us. Reporting in Monroe, Kaylee Collins, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.